you can create Lambda functions using the Lambda Management Console. You can choose to deploy a function from a blueprint, which provides sample code to do some processing. There are a number of example functions for processing events from API Gateway, S3, DynamoDB Streaming, IT Automation, and other event sources and tasks. Blueprints are a really good way to explore how to code for Lambda. For this example, I'm going to author a function from scratch. I don't have any dependencies, so I don't have to create a deployment package. I give the function a name. I select the language runtime, in this example, Node.js. I select Create Function. The Lambda console code allows me to author and test code directly. I can amend the function code. In this example, I'm going to log the event object and return a name value from the input event. I deploy the updated function code, which then saves the function. To invoke the function from the console, I create a test event. I name the event and enter a test JSON payload with my name. I then save the test. I select test and Lambda then invokes the function. The handler receives the input event and processes the sample event. Under the execution results, I can see the response to the invoke, which is hello and the input name. The execution result also includes a summary of the invocation log, and the full logs are sent to CloudWatch logs. The report line includes the function duration and build duration, the configured memory and used memory, and then the cold start initialization phase duration, as this is the first time the function is invoked. I can invoke the function a few more times, which will now use a warm execution environment. You can see there's no init duration for these invokes. The Monitor tab provides more information, and I can link to metrics that Lambda sends to CloudWatch metrics and traces to X-Ray and CloudWatch service lens. I can use the Configuration tab to configure a number of Lambda settings. This function is configured for 128 meg of RAM, the minimum. I can increase this up to 10 gig. And the timeout is three seconds. I can configure this for up to 15 minutes. From here, I can also configure other function configuration settings.